What's going on everybody? Welcome to Married to Film. I'm Ralph and this is Shamanda. Right now we're episode 9 of Orphan Black. This was called Unconscious Selection. And we last left off. Kira got hit by a car. Oh crap. she ran away with Helena. She was about to go home. Yeah, I'm, I'm back. I said I didn't know if I was going to be back or not. I'm back. Um, <laughs> you did say that. <laughs> <laughs> you got anything you want to add? Yeah. Oh, and Kasima got played by uh, the French chick. She should have known that. Should have known. Mm -mm -mm. All right, let's go. What's happening? It looks like Kira's going to be okay. What does it look like me? Well, she's been sedated, but her blood pressure and breathing is stabilized. Her ribs are intact. There's no internal bleeding, no head trauma. <laughs> I think she's going to be fine. She was run right off where I saw it. And she's a very lucky girl. But he's getting ready to report this to somebody else. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so it was no... So what did he see? No no hemorrhaging, no blood? Yeah, yeah, so she's perfect. Like it was perfect? Is she not real? Right. Who's the daddy? <laughs> yeah. Who the baby? Why did we ain't thought about that this whole night? <laughs> like, who the baby daddy is? And she ain't never mentioned it either. Mm -hmm. You want me to throw my ex-partner under the bus? Hmm? If I'm wrong about this, you'll be the last partner I ever had. Hmm. You are. She want to be sure. I'm starting to wonder. She's a monitor. She has something on you. In the day edge. What is that? I don't know. In the day edge. Oh my this God. is bullshit. Hello, Felix. 
gay friend. The acting coach. Oh, that, that's perfectly fine here. Which one? Yes, yes. Please join us. <laughs> Allison, Is it your which friend one? Is great strength in, in setting aside their pain and hurt in order to talk with you today. She beat that butt. She beat that girl's butt. Why she ain't got a black eye? Um, mm -hmm. Donnie, why don't you go ahead and get us started? Uh. Yeah. Allison. The pills and the drinking, it has to stop. Who's that? Felix Dawkins. Your look-alike Sarah Manning's monster brother. Yeah, and? You visited this place a few weeks back with 75 grand in your trunk. Today, I stopped you from skipping town. It's all coming back to the Maggie Chen shoot. You don't want to go there, right? You put the phone in Maggie Chen's hand. You helped me make it look like it was an accident. I was trying to help my partner. Mm. This is your last chance to come clean with me, man. That's two minutes. Pull off. She got to spill her guts. We do what we gotta do. Oh, good stuff. I say it, pull off. He knows who you are. Yeah, and he knows we're in contact. Did you say somebody to Delphine? No, Sarah, I know. I, I, I just left her in my house. One step closer to Kira. Uh, I would never say anything about yeah, you. Yeah, look for your stuff. And there's the end of that. Because you messed up. Sorry for the precautions. No, no, no. I, I understand. Absolutely. Oh, okay. I was wondering if she's going to be by herself. She got gone. Years ago, one of their agents infiltrated our project. Maggie Chen. Woman by Sean. Yes. She and Tomas found Helena in a comic book. Then trained clone to kill clones. Brilliant, brilliant. That's brilliant. <laughs> so what, you want me to kill her? No, we don't want to harm her at all. We want you to bring her in. So we can deprogram her. Get her help she needs. You do this. And we can move forward I don't believe with a new understanding. You and your friends will be free to live as you choose. No monitors. Are you okay? Oh, she got all the beef on. Are you? Oh, are you? Well, I was, but... Didn't know him, huh? Delphine Cormier. Not Vero. You've already got your doctorate in immunology, don't you? Whoa! Yes. <laughs> I wanted to trust you. You can trust me. You told Ricky. I know these girls. I had to look at me. He says you're in danger. Of what? Do you, you don't know, do you? Then you're the real danger. Oh! Mm. This is backstabbing 101. <laughs> uh oh. Of course you can. You can face the music, eat some humble pie, hug it out, play possum. Ainsley's gonna think she's won, and you are gonna live the fight of the day. Mm -hmm. Oh lord. Yep, fix your face. You got lies, mistress. Can you help me get my face on? Yes. Cameras. They don't have cameras. Yeah. Ah! So this whole time they didn't have cameras. Right. I, th I thought they would. No, I think mean, it was they... word of mouth. I think someone told them that she jumped. And then this other lady walks in. Oh, she did see her face before mm. she did it. Let it be your jumper. <sighs> Why the Rick saw Why didn't nobody look at the tape? <laughs> Shit. We never saw it from this angle. And I thank you. Did you want to go off? For scrutinizing every detail of my life since the day I moved into this fishbowl, you have pried and snooped and gossiped about me. Like I was your own personal laboratory subject. How would you like it if I turned your life inside out? 
If I told all these people that Chad, your husband, slept with the spin class instructor long before me, well, maybe he <laughs> acts that way because you blew the roof around the cabin! Ooh. Okay, um, Allison, you see... No! <laughs> no more words! That went very well. I think it went well. Yeah. They stupid. Oh! Look, wow. she don't care. She says she sees herself every time she looks at her. Yeah, she didn't say that about nobody else. Go ahead. Thomas and Maggie Chan, the chick that Beth shot, okay. mm -hmm. were in cahoots. Killed. She killed her. Yeah. Were in cahoots. I forgot how they were in cahoots. No. They were probably the couple. Now that I think about it. But go ahead. I'm sorry. No, that don't make sense. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. They were in cahoots, but I forget how they were in cahoots. And I guess Beth found out or something. Were they trying to kill Beth or something? No. But they were in cahoots. They didn't I, can't about it. I can't remember how they were in cahoots. Something happened where Beth found some stuff out. And I don't even think that she knew about all of what they know now. 
But Thomas worked with Maggie Chan, found Helena in the convent. Mm -hmm. In the convent. Sorry. Um, but they trained a clone to kill a clone. So they trained That's Helena. It. That's what you were trying to figure I out. So, okay. yeah, yeah, I put it in my notes. Yeah. I, as soon as you said, right, you did this. And I remembered everything that they said, and I just started writing it down. So no wonder that they that he's been telling Helena that she's the original. The original she's the light. She's the light. Because she was found in the covenant. Mm -hmm. I mean, convent. Yeah. I said covenant, convent. But Thomas, um, go ahead. What you thinking? And Leaky wants Helena. Leaky wants. I don't know why he wants her. He that's the only one he knew about. He didn't know about Sarah Manning. Yeah. Yeah. But so here we are with we're thinking that Art's at the house with Mrs. S. Or we're thinking that mm -hmm. well you was like, no, nah, Leaky and Brad is together. I mean Paul. Brad. Paul. <laughs> Leaky and Paul is together. They went to the place where Sarah was, where she was hiding out, because she took his gun and went uh to get Helena. She really wanted to kill her, but she couldn't. She said every time I look at her I see something. I see me. I see myself mm -hmm. in her. Um, so much stuff is going on in this episode, but I'm trying to really talk fast just in case we do decide to do another one. No, we don't have time. Quit while we are ahead. Okay. It's so only we, we can do it tomorrow. It's only one more left in the season. It's the season finale. Oh, That's man. why I was like, we go. Yeah, we ain't even got to talk. All right. Hey. Um, Mrs. S said she got in contact with England people and they were scared. And they didn't know what was going on. Thomas locked Elena in the cage and she called um, Sarah to come and get her. They got a connection. Don't they, you they, feel have, it? they have a connection. Uh, Delphine, uh -huh. yeah. um, she can't really be whipped. She only slept with the girl one That's time. That's a big lie, though. How yeah. you gonna sit there and do that and then, but I'm sorry. That's a huge lie. You done put people's lives at stake. That's, I mean, she, was, she said. And then, but I really, no, give me some time. Don't sit here and try to. Tell me you really love no. No, but here's the thing that pissed me off. Cosima knew from the beginning that it was a that it was a trick. How mm -hmm. she le left the thing there, and she was talking to her boyfriend, and mm -hmm. um, that she knew that she had already um, that um, she met with Leaky. But when she found all the the stuff online, she said, "You already have your doctorate." And I'm like, "Why are you in this class acting like you're a student? Mm -hmm. You're already you are already qualified, honey. What are you doing?" And she was like, no. She said, he said that you were in trouble. Well, what trouble is trouble. it? And then you don't know because you're the trouble. Okay, come on. All right. Oh, Amelia. Amelia is the birth mom. She was 22 years old. Somebody came to her. A couple came to her and said, we're going to do in vitro. And she was like, okay, let's do it. A whole lot of money, blah, blah, blah. But she kept figuring out all these little side conversations weren't right. Mm -hmm. So she was like, well, that ain't right. And she, they used unfitted by tradition. And then they used the neural, neurolution word in in a conversation Neo, and she said neo lucian Neo-Lucian, sorry neo lucian in a conversation and she said someone right so she ran cape town is her hometown she ain't even from the state mm -hmm. state and church she had twins oh i don't want out of focus <laughs> state and church mm -hmm. they split the twins mm -hmm. all right so we'll see y'all on the season finale yeah bye <laughs> hey, wake up.